in his debut season in the Big Apple, Jalen Brunson has unmistakably proven himself as a rising star in the NBA, averaging a career-high 24 points per game, along with 6.2 assists per game, and an impressive 41.6% accuracy from three-point range in the 2022-23 season. Brunson's performance has been nothing short of stellar. However, his journey to becoming a leading NBA guard has been characterized by a slow and steady climb. Born in New Brunswick, New Jersey on August 31, 1996, Jalen Brunson's journey in basketball was set into motion by the rich athletic legacy of his family. His parents, Rick and Sandra Brunson, introduced him to the world of hoops from a tender age. Rick, a former NBA player, had navigated the league for almost a decade as a journeyman, leaving an indelible mark on Jalen's early years. However, the transient nature of his father's basketball career presented challenges for young Jalen. The family moved seven times, making it difficult to establish a stable home. Amidst this nomadic lifestyle, the Brunsons finally found a sense of permanence in Lincolnshire, Illinois in 2010. It was here that Jalen honed his skills and played out his high school career at Stevenson High School. Jalen's passion for the game was more than just a hereditary trait. It was a way of life. The roots of this passion can be traced back to his formative years when he observed his father's relentless dedication to the sport. Rick's 12-year-long pro career became a nightly spectacle for Jalen, who, at the age of two, began immolating the basketball rituals he witnessed. In the Brunson household, basketball wasn't just a sport, it was a family affair. Sandra Brunson, Jalen's mother, fondly recalled the impromptu basketball courts that would materialize in their grandparents' kitchen and living room. New York Knicks stickers adorned the hardwood floors, and a young Jalen, complete with sneakers, shorts, and a jersey packed into a duffel bag, would announce his departure to the game, donning a blazer over a vest. The ingrained work ethic instilled in Jalen Brunson manifested prominently during his high school years. In a defining moment during his sophomore year, Brunson showcased his leadership by guiding Stevenson High School to a state championship victory against a formidable Simeon Career Academy, featuring standout players like Jabari Parker and Kendrick Nunn. His junior year saw him emerge as a five-star recruit, averaging an impressive 26.1 points and earning the title of Illinois Gatorade Player of the Year. Amidst a plethora of college offers from renowned institutions like UConn, Michigan State, Kansas, and others, Brunson ultimately committed to Villanova. His freshman year at Villanova marked an immediate impact, securing unanimous recognition on the Big East All-Freshman team. By his sophomore year, Brunson continued to shine, averaging 14.7 points and 4.1 assists, earning unanimous selection to the 2016-17 All-Big East First Team. However, it was Brunson's junior year that witnessed an extraordinary leap in his performance, achieving consensus first-team All-American status. He not only claimed prestigious awards such as the Naismith College Player of the Year and the John R. Wooden Award, but also led the Villanova Wildcats to their second NCAA championship in three years. Despite Jalen Brunson's impressive college performances, his NBA draft entry didn't position him as a player set to make an immediate impact. Drafted in the early second round by the Dallas Mavericks with a 33rd overall pick, his early years in the league were marked by the significant presence of perennial All-NBA member Luka Doncic, the team's first-round pick. Brunson found himself in the shadows of Doncic during his initial seasons, averaging 9.3 points per game in his first year, 8.2 points per game in his second, and 12.6 points per game in his third. He worked diligently to find his footing. However, it was in his fourth year with the Mavericks that Brunson's pursuit of consistency elevated him to a prominent role in the team's starting lineup, marking a major breakout. Starting in 61 regular season games, he averaged an impressive 16.3 points. When the team faced challenges, particularly in a 10-game stretch in December where key players, including Doncic, were sidelined due to injuries and COVID protocols, Brunson stepped up. He consistently contributed double-digit figures and averaged 21 points while shooting an impressive 51.3% from the field. The turning point in Brunson's career came during the 2022 playoffs. With Doncic absent for the first three games, Brunson adopted a more aggressive scoring mindset, unlocking a new level of production, surpassing his previous scoring highs. He scored 30 or more points three times during Dallas's run to the Western Conference Finals. Brunson's exceptional performances during the playoffs exceeded the expectations set by the Mavericks. 
His skills, particularly in the absence of key players, caught the attention of other teams, leading him to join the New York Knicks on a notable four-year deal worth $104 million. Upon joining the Knicks, skepticism surrounded Jalen Brunson's fit within the team's basketball dynamics, thriving in a Dallas Mavericks offense that consistently featured three-point shooters. The concern was whether the Knicks could replicate this environment for him. There were also doubts about the hefty price the Knicks had paid for the young floor general, with questions lingering about just how good Brunson could be. Pundits and analysts acknowledged his skill, but given his shorter stature, defensive limitations, and lack of experience as a go-to player, many believed his ceiling and potential were somewhat limited, not an entirely unreasonable viewpoint. However, Brunson swiftly dispelled these concerns in his first season with the Knicks, showcasing his system-independent versatility that elevated him to star status. His ability to excel in any offensive system became evident, driving winning outcomes. In his initial 20 games, the Knicks' prized acquisition displayed an impressive performance, averaging 21.8 points and 6.7 assists per game, with an efficient 48.7% shooting from the field. Fans quickly fell in love with Brunson, as they witnessed the resurgence of top-tier point guard play, a rarity seen in decades. Brunson emerged as a team player who could not only orchestrate an offense to competency, but could also contribute significantly to scoring. His diverse skill set, including moves, fakes, pivots, floaters, fadeaways, and layups, provided the team with a reliable scoring option when the offense faced challenges. Teaming up with Julius Randle, Brunson played a crucial role in leading the Knicks to an impressive 47-35 regular season record, securing the fifth seed for the playoffs. Jalen Brunson's regular season brilliance transcended into an even more remarkable postseason performance, setting him apart as the sole Nick capable of sustaining consistent offensive production, leading the team through the playoffs to the second round. While the journey ultimately ended in the second round, the impact Brunson had on the Knicks' playoff run was undeniable. His postseason heroics solidified his standing not just as a key player, but as an indispensable asset. The narrative surrounding Brunson underwent a profound transformation from an initially perceived overpaid and unproven commodity to an underpaid, all-star caliber playoff standout. In less than a year, he has become the epitome of what Knicks fans could have ever hoped for in a franchise point guard, a player to build around with confidence and comfort for years to come. If Brunson maintains his trajectory of growth, continuing to refine his game, and exhibit the same determination and drive that has characterized his journey thus far, there's no doubt he's destined to emerge as a top-tier NBA player. His leadership, versatility, and ability to elevate the performance of those around him position him as a cornerstone for the Knicks' future success.